Hi there, uh, Aaron Engler, the Debt Professor here, giving you a quick tutorial today on how to get your interest rates lowered. I was actually watching an infomercial last night. It was just on in the background, and it was by Mr. Kevin Trudeau selling a book called Debt Cures. And I listened to him. He was going on and on about how he was saving people all these interest rates. And, um, you know, in one hour, we got the interest rates from 24% down to 5 and. Uh, I haven't read the book, but I do, I believe, know exactly what tactic he is using. So I'm going to go ahead and give that to you here today. I'm not selling you anything. I'm just going to give it to you for free and see if you can't get your interest rates lowered a little bit. It could help you save quite a bit of money. When it comes to getting your interest rates lowered and getting your creditors to work with you, the squeaky wheel gets the oil. That's something my mom always used to say to me, and, and I've found her to be right in most things in life. The squeaky wheel does get the oil. So what you have to do is you have to get on the phone and you have to call your creditors. What you're going to do is you're going to ask them if you are available for a lower interest rate, but there's a specific way that you're going to ask them. You're going to call up and ask and you'll get the customer service rep on the phone. You're going to say, based on my payment history, I just want to know, is there a lower interest rate available for my account? And at this point, they're going to say either yes or no. Just so you know, you can do this every single time you talk to your creditors on the phone you should be asking them if you are available for a better interest rate. It changes weekly, it changes monthly. Okay, so don't be afraid to ask. If you don't ask, you don't get. Now they're going to say one of two things. They're going to say yes, and if they did, if they say yes, then you're just going to save yourself thousands of dollars in interest rate. You're going to get your interest rate dropped, and you're going to do exactly what a, a consumer credit counseling program can do for you, basically. So that's a good thing. If you can get them to say yes, then you've saved yourself money and they've you know, basically just lowered your interest rate and all you had to do was ask. The reason you say based on my payment history is because you don't want them to go out and get an, and pull a credit report on you because that can actually hurt your credit score. So just say based on my payment history, can I get a better deal? And they will say either yes or no. What if they say no? Well, if they say no, you, you the game's not over yet. Okay, what you have to do is you have to act like a poker player and you're going to bluff. You have to bluff these guys. And what you're bluffing them with is you're saying, look, okay, you can't give me a better interest rate. I'm going to close my account. And threatening to do that will get you to, through to a different department. And that's why you threaten that. Don't be afraid to say that I want to close my account. It's not like they're going to say, okay, bye, click, and hang up the phone. There is a process that they have. And the reason they have this process is to make them more money. So if you say, you know what, I just want to close my account. The customer service rep that you get when you call into the 800 number is going to say, can you hold on one second, Mr. So-and-so, and they're going to transfer you over to a customer retention department. Every single credit card company has a customer retention department because if they didn't, they'd be losing a ton of money. So let's say your interest rates are at 18%. Well, you call up and you say, I want to close my account, and they put you through to the customer retention department. That guy's job is to get you to stay with the company. If you leave, the, the credit card company just lost whatever interest rate is going to be attached to the dollars that you have with them. And they want to keep that because the more money they have, the more, more of your debt that they have, the more money they make. It doesn't matter what the interest rate is on it, they're going to make money. So we want them to close it. You're going to call up and you get through that customer retention department by saying, I want to close my account. And they're going to say, well, why do you want to close your account? And at this point, you just have to go in and you have to wheel and deal. You say, look, I'm getting better offers in the mail. I'm, you know, I just, I think I can do better somewhere else, or I'm going to get a personal loan and pay it off. Whatever the reason is, it doesn't matter. What you want them to do is you want them to drop that interest rate, and that person on the end of the phone will have a much higher likelihood of being able to work with that interest rate. And you've seen the results. You know, I was listening to, uh, again, Kevin Trudeau and saying, you know, we got a guy from 24% down to 5%. Not undoable. You know, five percent to them is better than nothing. If you transfer that account somewhere else, or if you don't, if you move the account and they don't keep it, they're losing money. So, just know that, and say that you want to close the account. Get over to that department and see how low you can get the interest rate. You do, you've done yourself a good service. So, I hope that helped. Uh, I, I did put together some information here. Um, I've created a website called FreeDebtExam.com, entirely free. What it basically does is it asks you a series of questions and makes sure that you are pointed in the right direction with your debt. And why do I say right direction? Well, there's about five different avenues you can go if you live in the United States and you have debt. Most people choose the wrong one, and then they choose the wrong one again. 
they have about a 20% chance of choosing the right program. So why don't you get it right the first time, and if you need a program, why don't you figure out what that is? So go to the free debt exam, take the uh, test. It shouldn't take you more than uh, one and a half minutes is about the average time that it takes people. I will give you a free debt workbook at the end of the exam. It'll help you outline a budget. Uh, it'll help you figure out how much debt you really have. And you know, at the end of all this, you're going to know, you're going to have a much better idea of where you stand, how to get out of debt, and it is entirely free. Okay, so go there, take it. It's www.freedebtexam.com. If you need help with anything, always feel free to contact me. Again, my name is Aaron Englert. I am the debt professor. My email is there, Aaron E at debtprofessor.com. You can reach me on the phone at 888-992-3328. Uh, take the free debt exam. It will help you out. I hope you found this video, I hope you found it informative and hopefully it helps you get your interest rates lower. So if you need anything, definitely feel free to get in touch. If not, uh, good luck and get out of the debt the right way.